Hi guys, so Emad from E Vlogs. Uh, he's one of my colleagues. He has this vlog channel, and he has actually challenged me with this uh, bake mushroom challenge. So what I have to do is look at his video and understand how he bakes mushrooms and recreate that recipe. So what I did was um, I noted down his recipe. And the ingredients that I need. So I need mushrooms, onions, garlic, chili, uh, cream cheese, oil, seasoning, pepper, and chili flakes. I do not have mushrooms or cream cheese, so I need to go get it from the grocery right now. And I have to do all the clothes folding. A lot of work is pending, but who cares? I'm still gonna go and do this challenge first. See you at the grocery. So before I leave for the groceries, I will just take these uh, reusable bags which I always carry when I go to the grocery store. And let's see how can I turn the camera or I can just show it to you like this. So this is my to-do list. I have to get some other things uh, from the grocery. This, these are like uh, reusable bags that I use to put vegetables or anything that needs a separate compartment so that I don't have to have separate plastic bags for putting in onions or uh, other, other vegetables. And of course, that's my reusable mask and my wallet. We are good to go. And phone is here. I'm shooting over my phone. So see you. So it's quite late in the evening. As you can see, it's already quite dark. And I have two favorite grocery stores. One is called Viva and the other one is called Grandiose. So anything that's like budget or things that I need uh, in smaller quantities or the things that I know are of good brands, I go to this place called Viva. It's uh, slightly cheaper than Grandiose. Grandiose is more like a gourmet or like a slightly higher priced uh, place. So first we'll go to Viva, get, let's see what we get over there. And after that, we'll go to Vangios. On the side note, this is another Korean grocery store. So whenever I need tofu or anything that's uh, Southeast Asian, I always come here at the Kmart. So this is Viva. And this is like the more affordable store. So let's first go in over here. I especially love this place because they have dosa batter as well as parathas. Our list was cream cheese, so we have it here. Next up are mushrooms, so I see a lot of varieties. Let's see which works for us the best. So there is uh, shimji mushrooms, brown and white and we definitely need the white ones. specifically picked some bigger ones so that we can stuff them nicely with the cheese. My favorite fruit in the whole wide world. By just two ingredients and I already have my fat on the school. But these look really tempting. So I'm done doing my groceries at Viva. And you can see this is one bag and another. I came here just for mushrooms and cream cheese. And, but yeah, it's like my weekly groceries as well. So I'm done here. Now, so since I have all the other ingredients that I need for this recipe, I just decided to go home and go to Grandiose sometime later. And let's get into it. So I'm back from Viva and I have these two heavy bags that I shopped. And let's just get into what I bought. So lots of items lots of fruits vegetables and i'm going to quickly walk you through them so i did buy these uh, amazing soft cakes they are called jaffa cakes i they look very pretty so i'm hoping they taste good and uh, coconut milk because it goes with most of the recipes that i make then uh, this is something interesting it says uh, honey ginger tea. So let's see, it's a pre mixed tea. Uh, let's see how it tastes. Then we have my idli batter, idli dosa batter. Being Indian, I always need that. The main ingredient which was missing uh, cream cheese. So this is for our mushroom, uh, baked mushroom recipe. And uh, Milk because I'm trying to make my own uh, yogurt. I'm trying that, so I hope it works. I've never tried making my own yogurt, so milk for that, and just a sweet chili sauce. 
in the other bag going quickly this has mostly fruits and vegetables so these are all the bananas that i got then mangoes then avocado and pomegranate and the second main ingredient that was missing are these mushrooms hi guys so we are here for emma's challenge and i have all the ingredients where i'm going to quickly show you what all i have here so what i did is i separated the mushrooms from the stem so the stems are here there's cream cheese here some extra cheddar cheese here we have a uh, pepper here which i'm going to grind uh, chopped chili there's garlic inside this which i have just grated Ooh. yeah that's that and then i've also chopped onions so let's get started with the baked mushroom challenge since i'm going to cook everything together i need not be careful if there's some onion left here so i'm just going to put this here add all the mushroom stems to this cool device that my to be mother in law gave it to me as a gift it's so handy so useful i think it also won a red dot award the uh tupperware brand who did this so what you just do is lock this and then just pull it so so that's the end result so our basic prep is ready now i'm going to take you to the stuff so that we see how we actually cook it so i'm just going to add some oil to the pan and once it's hot i will add uh a mixture of uh, chilies onions and some mushrooms and the rest of the mushrooms which are chopped i here i'll add these later this has the uh, garlic as well once the onion is cooked i'm going to add the chopped mushroom stems and let it cook for a while when it's almost cooked i'm just going to add the pepper and also some salt since i have to wash my own utensils i'm just going to use the same pan and not put it in something else so like i think this much is enough looks good i feel like adding some cheddar as well so i'm going to add some of this this add to the gooeyness let's mix this as well so my mixture is ready my mushrooms are there and i have a plate here so i'm going to quickly arrange this and then i'm also going to stuff the mixture uh into the mushrooms so i think my camera tilted while i was doing this and i have to go and reset it again so these many fit here mm -mm. yeah yeah so i'm going to take this actually i have this cute spoon maybe i'll use this to stuff it in so yeah looks quite cool i'm going to just put this inside I think I might have got slightly bigger mushrooms. I wanted like a bigger space for stuffing it properly. So, I'm just going to continue doing this while you watch me. As you can see, these are stuffed already. So, I'm super excited. What I'm also planning to do is to just add some seasonings to the same. So I have multiple options. I'm just going to like sprinkle these over. So this is oregano, and we have lemon pepper. We have uh, shazwan sauce. I'm I think I'm not going to do this. And then we have sweet chili sauce. I'm definitely going to try this one. Mm. Sit and then oregano and some, and then the lemon. the rest and now we can experiment a lot with them let's see after they are baked i just didn't realize i knew that i don't have a 
like an OTG oven. I don't know. I hope I'm not catching Corona. Oh. I'm just having some small, tiny bit of cold. But uh, yeah, I'm just going to put these in the microwave and we're going to see if this works as well. And I'm going to set it to micro for a minute or two. And then let's just see what happens. So attempt one, it just oozed out. So I'm going to put it on the grill mode and see if that works out now. While they bake there, I take my earrings off and get back to work. <laughs> so I had to do some jugad. And I think it's ready now. The mushrooms are out. I'm going to try one and let's see how it tastes. Mmm. Mmm. So good. Mmm. I just finished the entire plate. It was so good. I made it slightly spicier. I would suggest to add less chili if you don't like spicy food. But now... <laughs> It's so good, but <laughs> yeah, I still have this entire platter left because I want to give it to Nana and Kunal and hence I'm I have kept it aside. I'll make it for them tomorrow. So I hope you enjoyed this video. Signing off for now. Bye. Just packed it into two boxes and I'm going to go and give it to Kunal and Nana. <laughs> On my way to deliver these. On my way to deliver these to Kunal and Nana. <laughs>